So we're actually back to this game to check out the newest update, which is... Do you know why the deserters kidnapped Astoria? Well, I... Ahem. <coughs> The quiz free update essentially with the upgraded visuals, textures, resolution pretty much all across the board, graphics enhancement. Alongside it, I actually want to play more of this to know if I will be continuing it in the future in terms of the storyline. And I did keep it just in case because I'm a like adventure person on the channel anyway, so that kind of like pushed me to pursue it more. <laughs> I remember I need to find the suspects in terms of the traitors or something, so we'll do that now. And then by the way see what's happening visually. Okay, I think it was this point. And with the graphics, like, things seem more clear up close. And the resolution isn't like crazy in the distance, but it's not like bad, bad. So it's kind of like pretty decent for the standalone. I'm not getting much of a read. Then you must try to penetrate your thoughts. I feel like this section was also repeated, but we'll see. A member of the commission? It's an honor, Agent. Captain Indu Sarai oh, yeah. at your service. I remember now. Okay, I... where? That Agent. Despite her personal opinion of Astoria, the captain seems unlikely to work with deserters. The last suspect is Staff Sergeant Dex Roto, the quartermaster of the Array. I'll leave this one to you. Okay, I'll be looking how I perform. Are you sure about that? Nice to meet you. Dex Roto, Quartermaster. Just call me Dex. What can I do for you, Agent? <laughs> Pretty casual for a military man, Staff Sergeant. Just not big on titles. No disrespect intended. I found this capsule that Cogson sent to you. Did you help the deserters? I've never seen that before. Besides, I wasn't even working that night. That note was sent to you. My name's not on it. I thought you said you've never seen it before. No, what I <laughs> meant is... Catch him! Somebody locked down his location. He disabled the security grid. Our sensors are down. We need to bring up the emergency schematics. Dex got stuck near the mortuary, our detention center. If he dies, we lose our lead on Astoria. Ward and I will handle this. Let's go. Time is of the essence. So hurry up. Uh, 
ฮะยูดูดอะฟลอเลสจ็อบรูดิ้งอัลต์เดอะโมลินเดอร์บอลดอนพอเราไปที่ศูนย์กลางของโรงพยาบาลคุณไปก่อนและคุณสังเกตผู้ชายฉันจะตามตัวในชั้นสูงสุดคุณจะพบเด็กในปริศนาฟอร์เมชั่นนี่เอาน How the game has come, but I also don't like how the subtitles go inside him. Like I don't see them. I built this when I worked as a field agent. It got me out of some tough scrapes. I want you to have it. Good luck in there. It's recharging over time. Okay. Staff Sergeant Roto ran into this wing. You see him. Don't let him leave. Understood. Before you go, someone in the TAC deactivated our entire security system, and all the prisoners broke free. You'll need that fancy blaster of yours. Those Red Abyss pirates aren't playing around. Oh. <laughs> Back up. I didn't read the message in time. The lockdown sealed the external doors. You'll need your hacking tool. Take the device off your arm and insert it into the sub e t h e r port. Connect the nodes to override the security system. <sighs> Okay. Got a death wish? It seems kind of awkward in terms of the dynamic. Mostly because this is meant to be a story game, but it's an interesting addition. They followed me here. I'm sorry, F. You always said that Red Abyss was trouble, but no work meant no food. I'll be out of here soon, and I'll make this up. Oh, I can't run. What to have a not so gorgeous view on the space? Also, is there like some sort of an aim? Kinda. It's very subtle. Find out what he's hiding. Dex knows where the deserters are hiding. That capsule there contains his dossier. Over there are some personal effects from his bunk. Get him talking, and when he starts to get emotional, knock twice on this door, and we'll move to the next stage. Press the button to start the interrogation.
so we need to like gather some information. What's happening there? It's the same situation that I had before with penetrating packs through the environment. Where were you going to meet Cogson and the others? I'm not telling you that. They're my friends. I won't sell them out. We found this in your rack. What is it? It's called a trimensional thriller. Probably wouldn't interest you. You'd be surprised. It's a documentary about the Trigelian insurrections. I mean, I'll be honest. <laughs> Sounds fantastically dull. Hmm, not a student of history, I guess. You know, so what I thought I was interested. About? Turns out I'm not. Okay. This hollow portrait we found in your cabin. Is this your mother? Yeah. She lives out in the wastes. Oh, we can do some mental pressure there. She seems like a sweet lady. Hardly sweet. She's tough as palladium. Raised me and my brothers all by herself. They kidnapped Astoria. Don't you care? Why should I care about some spoiled princess? Clearly you had strong feelings for her. You were reprimanded for acting inappropriately. That was... The... We used to sit together during briefings. I, I like to make her laugh. But the Major thought I was being overly familiar. I mean, clearly. Sounds like you were kind of sweet on her. Please. Guys like me don't stand a chance with women like that. We're different species. Part of you held out hope that maybe it could work out. Yeah, sure, maybe. You're never going to see her again, unless I can find her and bring her back safely. It wasn't supposed to go down like this. Got him right where you want him. When you're ready to take things to the next level, come see me. Let's talk about something else. But what does that mean, next level? I'll be back. Can't wait. Great work. He's ready to tell us everything. He just needs a little push. Would you rather intimidate him into confessing, or give him an incentive to confess? In other words, the carrot or the stick? <laughs> He's not cooperating. Time to teach him a lesson. Oh no! Each of these rooms open into space. I'll unlock the door, which usually raises the pulse of anyone inside. You can also space decks by pulling that lever. But if you do that before we have a confession, we'll have lost our only lead. Wait, well, I didn't say no what he meant. Wait, what are you doing? I wanted the couch, whatever. Tell me where the deserters went or take a swim in the stars. I'll tell you everything. Just keep the door closed. Nicely done, Ward. 
They went to meet with a pilot. It's this guy I know, Calden Morrow. He's got a ship with a hyperdrive that can take them out of the sector. Why would Calden help a bunch of deserters? If I had to guess, money. Big moral stands aren't really Cal's thing. I guess we're done, Cal. There's a planet that Cal uses when he wants to avoid Imperial ships, Tiger Three. There are these storms that screw with sensors. That was the meeting place. Now, can I get out of here? For space or no? <laughs> Okay, I'm not that of a monster. I'll tell them to let you go. Thank you. <laughs> Good job. Now we know where to find the deserters. What should we do with Dex? His crimes warrant a death sentence. But it is sometimes prudent to show mercy. It's your decision. I mean, he did it out of love, so I can forgive this. Let's go find these deserters. I like your enthusiasm. I want you to lead the mission to Tigra. But before you go, I need you to hold out your arm. How's <laughs> this? This is a subdural implant. It will travel through your bloodstream and implant itself near your parietal lobes. Through it, I can monitor your activity and we can communicate privately. Yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> so you'll be seeing through my eyes and listening to everything I say. In effect, obviously, I don't have time to monitor you every second, but I will be notified when you require my attention. This is Major Erigne. She is a member of the Viceroy's Imperial Guard and an accomplished tracker. She will accompany you to Tiger Three. However, you are in charge of this operation, Ward. Are we clear on the chain of command, Major? <clears throat> Absolutely. Just glad to have a chance to bring these traitors to justice. Good luck down there. Okay. I'll stop here because the time ran out and it's also a good moment because there's some kind of a transition to the next story. This update was all about the graphics and I didn't necessarily mind it because the quality seemed pretty appropriate for standalone. I would just have to review my previous video of this game to see if there's like a huge difference. But it's playable and that's what matters. There is some kind of interesting storyline going on. I wonder if like the decisions I'm making now will have a reflect on the others, aka like Telltale games, but the combat and the mechanics seem kind of awkward, so there's like two wars going on. Either way, it was cool to check it out and see what's up, so we'll have to see if eventually we'll continue this journey. 